Good morning. It is November 8th and I am already on the Lake Annette Trail. It is definitely starting to feel like winter here in the mountains and obviously today I'm going to be hiking to Annette Lake. I've been here before but this is a beautiful trail that I've been wanting to revisit and they've done some trail work on it so I'm very excited to see what it looks like and it's one of those trails that is beautiful in early winter conditions. This is about six and a half miles with just over 1700 feet of gain and it's going to be beautiful. The forest here is so pretty and there's so many waterfalls so I am very excited to get up to this beautiful lake. Let's get going. this trail and that would be the log waterfall it's so cool and it's like in full flow look at this thing it's coming right right down this log and then down the creek yeah that's one of my favorite parts of this trail is um there are so many little waterfalls and babbling brooks the entire way and this is a great time of year to do it because the rains are really in full force so all the water is flowing and it's so pretty but uh, the one waterfall going down the log is probably my favorite. You don't see that every day. Um, but yeah, if you like waterfalls and little creeks, this is a great trail. I am climbing up the switchbacks that are about the halfway point on this trail and I'm getting a peekaboo view of the hill and the mountains over there and there's some sun and also the snow is looking so pretty on the upper slope so I think that once we get to the viewpoint sections that it's going to be it's gonna be gorgeous, I think. Sun hitting snow-covered trees. <sighs> Beautiful. But I gotta keep climbing first. give you Lake Annette. I was right about the snow. Look at that. Oh wow. It is so pretty. Oh, oh my gosh. This is such a fun lake and one of my favorite things about this lake, and I said this before, is that if you look at it on a topo map, it is almost completely round, which I don't know, I just like that about it, <laughs> but wow, that is quite the mountain display for us. 
the way the light is just hitting. I think it's so much prettier with like the clouds creating this dappled light. Oh wow. Huh. And the best part, I am the only one here. This is exactly what I needed. It has been a pretty rainy November. Um, so this is the first day where we got some proper sun up in the mountains and it's not bad. I came around the other side of the lake and the view got even better. Look at Silver Peak up there with the clouds rolling over it and the snow. Oh, wow. Oh, this is such a good view. Um, but I guess this is probably the best spot for me to give the tour. Gosh, it's just so nice to see the sun reflecting off the snow. It's so pretty. Oh, wow. But anyway, I'll start with this is Lake Annette, making beautiful reflections. Up there is Silver Peak. I've climbed that a couple of times now. Still haven't gotten the view from the summit, but Silver Peak is looking beautiful. There's the waterfall on the other side that feeds the lake. And this is a Beale Peak. Um, and then the ridge you can see from the other side of the lake, that is part of Humpback Mountain. But wow, I didn't come to this side of the lake the last time I was here, and I'm so glad I I'm so glad I did. I didn't think there was a better viewpoint here, but there is. <sighs> wow. Yeah, that's definitely my favorite part of the view now. Silver Peak covered in snow with the trees. Gorgeous. Well, I enjoyed a beautiful solitary time at the lake and I think that's one of my favorite things about this lake is it's very peaceful um, and it really is like perfect shoulder season hike but um, now I have a gorgeous walk back through all of these little babbling brooks snowy mountain views and old growth trees and the sun is finally hitting some parts of the trail. So I'm gonna get to warm up because I got chilly. I made it back down and wow, Lake Annette is one of my favorite trails around here because it is just so pretty the whole way. Like most of the trail is in the woods, but it's really pretty forest. There's some beautiful old growth trees. There's all these little babbling brooks and creeks and waterfalls. And then the lake itself is very tranquil. Um, my favorite part of lakes like this is just the reflections and stuff when they just act like a mirror. It's so pretty and wow, this was a great late fall hike. I timed it just right. So like the snow line was just above me at the lake. So you can see all the snow covered mountains and trees, but like the lake is still melted out and stuff. And wow, that view of Silver Peak is definitely worth coming back for. Anyway, I do highly recommend this trail. I think it's a really good beginner hike if you are, you know, wanting to get into it around here, depending on like your um, fitness level and stuff. It's really nicely graded. It's pretty. 
Um, so check it out if you are in the area. It's really fun. I enjoy this one a lot. Um, anyway, thank you so much for watching. And here are my favorite pictures from the trail today. Enjoy.